Are you serious? Are you serious? You are looking at over in Prince William Sound up in Alaska, about 60 miles from Anchorage. You're looking at this massive wall of water which would threaten potentially hundreds and hundreds of people in a massive tsunami if the uh, area there called the Berry Glacier, if it was to break off and slide, which it is doing. It's creeping right now, and it has been for some time, and it's going to go. It will create a massive landslide, in, uh, and when it does, it will cr crash into the waters, which will then create a massive, massive tsunami. Can I put a shout out right now, guys? Because seriously, that is really wild when you think about it. That is really, really wild, uh, this glacier, okay? I mean, uh, and are, are these things going to happen someday? Absolutely. It's already, scientists are just trying to figure out when it's going to actually take place. Uh, but there you can see what it looks like. Just real quick, guys, I don't know about you, but during the lockdown, it's been insane. Uh, I've been doing a lot of things differently, and so have a lot of other people, okay? Uh, the old life of your daily office commute just isn't happening anymore, and you can't say you missed that drive. I know you can't. But talking to a lot of people over on Zoom and Facebook and, you know, Skype and different things, they feel the same way about a lot of things, and they've been recommending apps TV programs and other ways of making life better, not just for now, but on an ongoing basis. If you've seen the returns on the stock market since the beginning of the year, since the virus hit, it's very clear that the old ways aren't working too well. The Fed is having to prop up the returns. It's pumped trillions of dollars into the system to try and avoid what looks like an inevitable collapse. You can have 20% unemployment that's over 26 million jobs without massive fallout. You can't spend trillions bailing out businesses without consequences. Guys, that's just, okay? Uh, so what we have to do is we need to secure a way to uh, literally to guard, guard your savings, your investments, and your wealth. Gold and silver and palladium and platinum have proven to be a safe haven investment. It is the only investment with appreciation, not depreciation, but appreciation value during economic collapse. So if you're interested in securing your wealth, your savings, your investments, call noblegoldinvestment.com. That's www.noblegoldinvestments.com. That phone number is 877-646-5347. That's 877-646. 5347, call Colin Plume or one of his associates and uh, let him help take care of your financial needs. Tell him Pastor Bagley sent you. There it is, guys. That's the glacier. And that glacier is going to go right up here at the top. It's what's called the Berry Glacier Landslide. You can see it. It's breaking away. It's sliding. And when this massive landmass, when it goes, it will crash into the waters and it will create a tsunami so massive it will wipe out hundreds of people. It's not a question of if it's going to happen. It's when is it going to happen. And believe me, it is going to happen. The scientists are now saying that we could be within one year at any moment of this massive landslide going. Of course, with all the earthquakes that go on up there in Alaska, uh, you know, it's basically we're, we're looking at a ticking time bomb. So... Keep your eye on that. Pray for the folks that live in that area. I know they're fully aware of it. Uh, everybody's been told. Of course, it's never, you know, if, obviously something like this, if it's not happened before, then, you know, it's just, it's out of sight, out of mind. It's sort of like a volcano or like an earthquake at San Andrea Fault Line or some other place in California or even the Cascade Subduction Zone, you know, they, or, or Yellowstone eruption. Everybody knows it's going to happen. New Madrid fault line. Everybody knows it's going to happen, but but because it, it's happened before, the New Madrid fault lines happened before. In 1811 and 1812, it was so powerful it rolled the Mississippi backwards. And if that exact same quake hits again, it will just wipe out St. Louis, Missouri, and Memphis, Tennessee. And everybody knows it, but it's been 200 years, so you know, 
And um, everybody knows that the Cascade subduction zone is going to go. There's going to be a massive earthquake creating a tsunami of biblical proportion that could wipe out 7 million people in the Seattle area. Everyone knows it. It happened before in the year 1700. But that's 320 years ago. Nobody's worried about it right now. So I'm saying this one here, though, you know, you got to let people know. And that's what they're doing. Scientists are letting people know that the Barry Glacier landslide is destined to happen. Okay? So heads up to everybody up there in Alaska, and we're praying for everybody. God bless all of you guys. We love you. Uh, Wow. Tomorrow's going to be a very important day. Uh, We're going to be looking at all the current world events. I'll be back later tonight with another update. Keep praying one for another. We're living in the last days. And there was a UFO or some type of, that's what they call it. I I don't know what it was. I wasn't there. But they're calling it a UFO crash in Brazil with thousands of people saw it crash into the Brazilian forest. I'm not sure what it was. But uh, we'll, we'll let you know more about that. Plus there's a lot more. God bless.